The Memphis Grizzlies in Indiana to take on the Pacers on a Thursday night. Paul George with 17 points and 12 rebounds in his debut Wednesday. Mark Gasol and the Grizzlies come off a 30-point beatdown by the Cavs. They'd get back in sync early on. That's Jeff Green to Gasol for the dunk, putting him up 13 to 6 in that first quarter. Then Gasol with the nice pass to Bano Udri for the top layup underneath. That would give the Grizzlies a nine-point lead. And Miles Turner in his rookie debut. Here he is with his very first NBA basket, the putback dunk off the Monte Ellis miss. Then Turner, yet again, this time in the second quarter, the baseline jumper. Memphis still up by three at that point. Here, later on in the second, Daniel Udry finds Gasol for the one-handed dunk on that pick and roll. The Grizzlies would lead the way by one at the half, 50 to 49. Then in the third quarter, Rodney Stuckey looking for Paul George. He'd find him underneath the reverse lay-in. Indiana up 65 to 61. Then later on in the third, Stuckey to CJ Miles for three. That would give Indiana the eight-point lead, 71 to 63. And to the fourth quarter, Jeff Green driving and throwing the alley-oop to Brandon Wright, who throws it down to tie things up at 75 apiece. Now Brandon Wright missing the free throw here, but keep an eye on Jamaica Green. The follow-up dunk, Memphis up 85 to 83. Then Paul George left open here after the screen. And he'd take advantage, knocking down the three. He finished with 18 points, eight rebounds, and five assists on the night. But Jeff Green firing back on the other end of the floor. There's three. He had 12 points off the bench. Then Mike Conley and Marcus Saul. Look at this pick and roll here. Conley bouncing it to Gasol. And he'd get the layup to go. Memphis up 101 to 96. Now, late in this game, Lavoy Allen swinging it to Monte Ellis for three. Memphis still up by two, 101 to 99. And firing back yet again on the other end of the floor, Conley this time. Using the pick and pop to find Marc Gasol for the jumper. That would improve their lead to 103 to 99. The Pacers trying to fight back, but George Hill throwing the bad kick out pass. Tony Allen has the steal. He'd miss the layup, but Mike Conley would be there to tip it in. The Grizzlies win it, led by seven Grizzlies in double-digit scoring.